just me today. I do not have a guest. I have a few topics that I want to get into today, but before I get into the topics that I want to talk about today, I just want to say thanks to everyone who has shown support in any way. I'm not going to just, I'm not going to give you the full rundown and list of thanks for this and that and the other. Just in case you didn't know, the best ways to stay connected are to follow me at Slightly Daily on every social media account, YouTube included. If you go to the homepage, I just recently added a direct link. You just click on the little YouTube icon icon at the top. I added a direct link to the YouTube page. I don't want to get too much into this and you'll see why once I make my points about it, but I do want to talk about Juice World's death. Before I really get into this, I just want to say I'm not using this as like clickbait or anything. That's kind of what I want to talk about is when a tragedy or like a rapper dies or something it's becoming like a trend on social media and twitter and instagram and stuff to where you like use that person's name for clickbait and it's it's kind of disturbing and disgusting a lot of memes being posted that are in very very poor taste and i think that's just absolutely disgusting yes he was juice world to you but he was also a grandson and a cousin and a friend and a brother and a a boyfriend and who knows he might have been a father one day and now he won't be and he was so young I saw him, I got to see him at Bonnaroo this year, which I feel very thankful for that because he had such a short career. I mean, I'm sure he toured a lot and had a lot of shows, but a lot of his fans didn't have a chance to see him and thankfully I was able to. Before I before I get right into this next, I just want to say follow at Slightly Daily and go to SlightlyDaily.com. Uh, also, follow me on Apple Music at Slightly Daily. Look me up. I've, I just made a... a cold season playlist cuddle season playlist whatever you want to call it for you and your boo um now i want to talk about the fact that it's friday night and i'm sitting here in front of this camera but now i want to talk about before i get off here i just want to remind you guys that there are many many ways for you to stay connected this is episode five of the slightly daily podcast i'm gonna have more guests on here. I'm trying to get more comfortable in front of this camera. This is something that my spirit just keeps telling me that I need to do is try and learn how to make podcasts and get back into my YouTube stuff. Whenever I make these solo videos, they're going to be much shorter than like a full length feature, feature podcast. Speaking of vlogs, I also re-uploaded, I guess, some old vlogs I had from Bonnaroo and Bonnaroo 2018 and a couple other random blogs I did. Go check those out. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you want to be on this show, come sit in the chair. Contact me in any way. It's 2019. If you, like I just said at the beginning of the video, if you want to get connected, you will. 